Well, hello, welcome to Izzy's Tarot. Thank you for coming to my channel. You could have been anywhere, but you came to my channel. And for that, I'm always extremely grateful. Thank you so much. I am going to do a Capricorn Love Prediction reading for May 3rd through May 9th. Please keep in mind, this is a general read. If it's not your story, it's not your story. Don't try to make it your story. Just take what you can from it and leave the rest. In addition, please keep in mind that the energies can go either way. It can be your energy or the person that you are uh, in affiliation with or who you are with or who's your significant other or who you're thinking about being your significant other. Also, if you enjoy my readings, please give me a subscription or a like. I will be most humbled. I'm always honored and very grateful if you decide to do that. As I always tell you, you will not be disappointed. Let's see what's going on with my Capricorns for May 3rd through May 9th. What's going on? Thank you, Spirit Guys, for coming to my channel. Thank you, Ancestors. Let's see what we got going on. Oh, Knight of Cups, Judgment card, the Moon, Four of Pentacles, and Ten of Swords. Well, you start off the uh, you start off the week of May third through May 9th as the Knight of Cups, and the Knight of Cups. Is that you are trying to offer, you want someone, because you have the judgment card next, you want someone to realize that you are it for them. Because the Knight of Cups means that you are showing them that you are charismatic. You are showing them that you have loyalty. You are showing them that you have love for them. You are showing them everything. You are giving your heart to this person. You need them to realize because the judgment is card is here, you want them to have an, a realization that you are the it person for them. You want to be the it person for them. This person puts you in a world, you in a world of a, you're just crazy about this person. I think you just really, 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 really want to be with this person. Now, this person, I think, moves your heart space in a different way. Um, and you just can't, you're crazed about them. You just don't know which way to go. That moon card could also, um, it just does it means you just, you just don't know. You don't, you're not sure which way to go. Um, the moon can also be a Pisces person as well. But then you have that four of pentacles because you know what? You're trying to get your stability back because I don't think that this person, um, figured it out. And you don't understand why because this moon, you're, you're crazy. You're, you're in a state of just, uh, just mania trying to figure out why you can't get them to understand what you want and what you are and how you are and what kind of person you are. So you're trying to get your stability back with this four of pentacles. You're really trying to get your stability back. And I do believe that based off of this, you, <laughs> the ten of swords means that it's done and it's over. It does mean that it's done and it's over. The stability that you're trying to get back Hopefully you got it back because I do believe that this is saying it. We're going to finish reading. Let's see what the spirit guys say through the cards. But that ten of swords means that this situation could be done and could be over. So let's see here. Show me spirit guys. Give me another three to five minutes just so I can tell you the story the spirit guys want me to tell you. Um, just give me just a few moments and let me clarify the cards. Why is this knight of cups here for you? Show me why the knight of cups is here for my Capricorns. Why is the Knight of Cups here for my Capricorns? Ah, uh, see, I told you. Thank you, Spirit Guides. This could be a Leo person as well, but you are trying with the Strength card. This is a Strength card. The Strength card means that you're trying to tame someone. She's sitting on top of that line. She's taming that person. See, I told you, you're trying to get them to understand that you are their person. You are their person. You need them to understand that and they're not getting it. They're not getting it. They're not understanding. They're not, they haven't had the realization yet. Um, and you're trying, like I said, with this Knight of Cups to offer them everything. So let's see. Loyalty, love, char you're charismatic toward them. Um, you open car doors for them if it's a man. Um, you do everything for them, for them to understand. You cook if you're a woman. You do everything. Let's see why the judgment card is here for you. Uh, you have the five of cups. See, 
Thank you, spirit guides. The spirit guides are saying that I'm definitely telling you this story that's supposed to be told. They have not realized it, and you are in a space. You are your, your heart space is low. You are depressed about this. You are low about this situation because you really, really did care for them. There's three cups down, Capricorn. There's two cups behind you, honey. There's somebody coming in behind you. Don't worry about it. But I know it's easier said than done when your heart is there. And if they're not realizing, they just realize that they did. They messed it up, not you. They will realize it as as time moves on. But move on. Don't get stuck in that energy of despair and heartache. Move on. Let's see why the moon card is here for you, Capricorn. Oh, Capricorn. Oh, Capricorn. Stop the stinking thinking. It's not you. It's them. You can't sleep. You can't eat. I told you this moon card means that you're in a state of just... Whew, I can feel your energy, Capricorn, and I'm very sorry. But, you know, you can't make someone love. You can't make someone figure it out. But you just, you, you're just all in your head space. You're not, you're all in your head space. You really are. Let's see why the four of pentacles is here. Why is the four of pentacles here? Eight of wands. <laughs> you're still trying, aren't you? You're still trying to tell them what you can do. You can bring them stability. You know you can, Capricorn. They don't get it, Capricorn. I'm sorry. They're not getting it. Move on. Don't keep bat um, battering yourself. Don't keep just trying to hit yourself in every which way. Don't try to keep convincing them. You don't need to keep having conversations with them. It is what it is. Move on. Don't don't do that. Let it go. If they don't understand what they're missing, they don't they're not your your plus one forever. They're not your person. Don't stay in that energy. We often stay in energy sometimes for far too long. Show me why the ten of swords is here for my Capricorns. Wow, Capricorn. Bam. You got the tower. So this is a done deal, a done situation, a done dollar, as another reader always says. This is a done dollar. This is a done situation. Move on. Move on. Get your heart space in the right place. Let me see what the angel oracle cards have to say to you. Let's see what the angel oracle cards have to say. Oh. They say forgive. In other words, forgive for you more than for them and move on. Here you try to offer them all your Knight of Cups, all your good things that you tried to offer them. Then you have the Strength card, which means that you were trying to tame them to get on the same page with you. This could be a Leo person. You wanted them to realize what you were. They didn't realize that you went into depression or you went into despair. Your heart was hurting. Then you have the Moon where you were just all in your head, which shows with the Nine of Swords. The Moon card means you were crazed about this situation. You wanted to show them once again. You kept going back because you have the Eight of Wands. You kept trying to show them... I can have stability. We, I can make you stable. Forget that. You let them figure it out. And then you have the Ten of Swords, which means it's over. And you have the Tower, which means that everything blew up. It's a done deal. Forgive. Move on. That's what I have for you, Capricorn, for your love prediction reading for May 3rd through the May 9th.